been using this new Garmin Striker 4. Man, this thing was the best purchase I've made this year. Oh yes, oh yes. Up Real Killer Fishing fans, we're here for another edition of that Real Killer Fishing, and we are on a fishing mission. We get out here, use that new Garmin Striker 4 I got, we're gonna get us a dang fish. Let's get out here and get this done, y'all. Hey. Man, that daggum wind might only be blowing about five miles an hour, but goodness gracious, right now it is so chilly. Kind of a little ridiculous. Right. Come over here. Turn that on. That is what I'm seeing off the side of my throat. There's some fish at three, five, four. Okay, I'm sure y'all can see that. But it goes right on a little suction cup. Comes right on over. Goes right over here battery in the back which also goes to this and I've been running this thing for a good majority of the day it's about 11 30 or so and I've been going since 6 30 7 o'clock so this thing runs pretty good on that battery for a good amount of time this was definitely an awesome purchase. Well, you would think I'd learn my lesson. I was out here fishing on the main body for a while. Everything was going really well. Beautiful day. The wind was just a little baby bit. The sun was out. Good clouds. And then I was retying a little lure I was trying to use for crappie fishing. And I felt this gust of wind come across me. I looked up and said, oh geez, I should have headed in a long time ago. But if you ever get yourself in one of these situations like I tend to do, and you got a little drone boat like this, 10, 12 footer, whatever, I got a 12 footer, it works real fine for me. But when you gotta come across and break these waves, always come at a crisscross diagonal pattern. You can get a lot further real fast, keep the corner of your boat to those waves, 
and you won't be having a bunch of water splat that brought in the damn boat. And uh, that'll help you a lot. Just do a little zigzag crisscross type thing and you'll be real good. You go right into that stuff and your boat will be full of water in about 10 minutes. And you'd be wishing you hadn't have done that. Just a little tip for y'all. I do believe my fish finder found me some fish. I was getting tip tap pretty good. Oh yeah. Oh, it's on. Oh god, he just wouldn't take it. Gosh dang it. I'm about to lose my mind, y'all. Oh yes, thank you, freaking thank you. Okay, all right y'all, thank goodness, look at that. Look at that, look at that. So on a Texas rig, we're look, a little freaking high tech. Goodness gracious, that's my first one. Of the, look at this little dude trying to bite me. He's out of control. Think you can calm down, sir? Goodness gracious. Oh, God. All right, this water is cold. I'm going to let him go. There you go, dude. Whew. Thank goodness, y'all. That's my first pass in like two weeks. Oh, man. was freaking fantastic. Let me put my pliers up for uh, do something stupid. Man, it is for real struggle bussing. But you can't give up. I've had, shoot, I don't know, probably five, six different things tied onto here. I've tried quite a few different little things, but as y'all can see, what finally worked was this Tide Tech right here. <clears throat> I just had that thing with a little bullet weight, a little no turn hook on there. That's what ended up doing it for me. Been using this new Garmin Striker 4. Man, this thing was the best purchase I've made this year the spots beautiful it's back here in this back creek uh, one of my favorite spots to go I thought I was actually gonna pull one off of here but I got them from over here let me throw back in and see if I can get another one I ain't done with this day we got more daylight to go for sure let's get this y'all real killer fishing time All right, y'all, we got out here, did some fishing, did a few things, got everything taken care of. We uh, just had to walk across that with a semi-extensive boots, but that's all right. We got out here, I didn't do very good this morning, didn't do very good this evening. We're checking out and trying out the fish finder. It works freaking awesome. I love my Garmin Striker 4. It's one of the best things I've ever bought for sure off of Amazon. But... I finally caught me a fish today. Make sure you hit the thumbs up for that. Subscribe down below. Follow me on Instagram at Real Killer Fishing. And soon we'll be there for that giveaway for the two Mondo boxes. So, like I said, make sure if you haven't already, subscribe down below. It helped me out a lot. I appreciate it. 
they give me a little bit of support let me know that y'all like what i'm doing if you want to see anything else just put a comment down below let me know until i see y'all next time y'all go get bent later